Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you the dynamic server system that I was working on, integrated with MMO starter kit. But first of all, I want to show you something. I have modified the character structure on the database to include uh, the map name. You can see one of the players is located on map number one, and the other is located on map number two. Now I'm going to launch two instances of MMO starter kit and use two accounts to connect. You can see that the number of players per server instance is limited to one only. Okay, here we go. You can see the loading screen. Let's wait a few moments. The first player spawned and second one also spawned one on the map number one and the other is on the map number two. So now let's try to invite the other player to a group. Okay. So you can see that even if you are not on the same server you can invite each other to a uh, group, but you can see that the uh, health bar is grayed out. So now I'm going to try to move the, to the map number two, but keep in your mind that the number of player per server instance is limited to one, so a new server instance yeah. should be created for this player, because this one is full. Here we go. Each of the players is Locate on a separate server now. You can see that the HP bar still grayed out. So now I'm going to try to enter a dungeon. Since they are on the same group, they should enter the same dungeon instance. You can see the dungeon name here. Okay, there we go. A new instance launched. Okay, the player number two joined it. And now I'm going to try to go by the player number one to the dungeon also. Okay, let's spawn on the same dungeon because both of them are on the same server, uh, sorry, uh, on the same group. So now we can see that the HP bar is working. Let's try it. It is changing. Okay. What's yours? Now I'm going to try to go back to map number one by both players to show you something. So let's say one of the servers shut down because of a DDoS attack. What will happen? I need to shut down one of the servers that's loading map number one. Okay, this one contains map number two. So let's close this one. You will notice that uh, the system detected it and restarted it immediately. The player should uh, reconnect to it and it will restore its last state. You can see that the group is now uh, working also. And everything is uh, restored. I'm going to try to test the chat. Here is the public chat working. And we can try the group chat. It's working also. And then we will try the clan chat.
Okay, it's working. Both of the players are the, are on the same clan, so the message should be received by the other player. Thank you for watching. See you soon.